how are you guys doing today? Thank you so much for taking the time out of your day to view this video. We are truly in gratitude to you. Many blessings to you and your family. Health, peace, health, and harmony to you and your lives. Um, hopefully well, what we share today can um, take your mind off of what's going on in this world and put a smile on your face. Hopefully we could uh, raise your vibration, raise your frequency and set you on the right timeline, brother. Set you on the right timeline because once you raise your vibration from inside, your thoughts, your feelings outwards, nothing can stop you, Jack. I got three great customs that I want to share with you and two great reviews. And if you don't know, well, now you know. It's Legends of the Squared Circle on Facebook. It's the Rambros Collectibles on eBay, store name, that item name. On Instagram, it's wrestling, un custom wrestling underscore lucha underscore figures. I'm pretty sure you'll find something there that you would enjoy and love because that's what our intent is here solely, is to raise your vibration, raise your frequency, and put some joy into your heart. With what we create, that's our ultimate goal, number one. Hopefully those that view it, it'll bring some joy into their life and it will trigger some childhood memories of joy, you know, and set you guys on the right path. And whoever gets it in their, in their uh, collectibles and, and gets to display it, whoever views it may bring them joy. That's our pure intent here, brother. The first figure that I want to share with you guys I shared one a couple of videos back. We did a, a customization of him, but this is a different color. It's a little bit bigger figure, and it's of the great heart puncher himself, Ox Baker, brother. He wrestled in Canada. He wrestled in Japan. Man, but check this one out, brother. And as I'm speaking to you right now, that's why I was such in a hurry to get it on the video. It's already sold, brother that fast i created it the next day i put it up it was gone but check that out brother i think that looks pretty cool if i do say so myself but i'm biased brother because i created it he's got the hair on the chest he's got the eyebrows he's got the goatee brother check out the eyebrows on there brother wow like none other he's got the brown tights with the yellow stripe down the side He's got the ox on the, on, the, on the tights there. He's got the all black boots with the white trim and the white wrestling laces, brother. His agility, his mobility, and his in-ring capability was through the roof, Jack. It's like these kids say nowadays, fire. His wrestling IQ was through the roof like none other above and beyond, brother. So this is our trip, Durant Custles tribute, paying tribute, paying homage to the great Ox Baker, brother. Wow, what a great figure, brother. Whoever picked this one up has a great custom figure there to add to the wrestling collection, brother. Hopefully it brings them joy for as long as they have it, brother. The next custom wrestling figure that I wanna share with you guys today is wrestling superstar number two. Or superstar, mass superstar, number two. He was no, it was Big John Stud, right? That was under there, <laughs> under that mask. Well, that's the one that I made. And he's got the all black, sinking on the black tights with the red stars on them. The red burgundy boots with the white trim, the white laces, brother. The red star in the front and the other stars on the other opposite side, brother. He's got the burgundy mask with the gold trim, gold stars on it. Check out the back, the back detail, brother. This is all handcrafted, brother. This is no 3D printing on there, brother. All handcrafted on there, brother. By yours truly. He's got the hair on the chest, brother. This is Duran Customs. This is Duran Bros Collectibles. Paying tribute, paying homage to the mass superstar number those. 
Number those. Number two, brother. Wow. Check that out. A.K.A. Big John Stud. I think that's a... And like I said, as soon as I put this one up, totally different buyer. It was gone. They're getting shipped out tomorrow, brother. 100% feedback. 100% feedback, brother. 100% feedback. Because to me, my customers come first. They're number one, brother. They're number one. I make sure that they're happy, brother. Then next, I don't know if you guys know this lately, but I've been working out, Jack. Check out the lateral deltoids and the pictorial regions, brother. The next custom figure that I want to share with you guys, brother, was one half of the powers of pain. They started off in the NWA before uh, Vince picked them up, brother. Because they didn't have the Road Warriors. So they wanted something similar. Well, wait a minute. They had Demolition. But this was a totally opposite one. This wasn't the Road Warriors. But it was close enough too, brother. I'm talking about one half of the Paros of Pain. The Barbarian. The Rand Customs. The Rand Gross Collectibles. I did it according to the NWA version, brother. Totally different head. I can't tell you who I use, brother. You tell me who I use for that. Check out that painting on there. The goatee. Powers of pain, brother. Powers of pain. But if you buy this, you get both of them for the price that's on there. You get both the Barbarian and the Warlord. Custom ones. I think that's pretty cool. All handcrafted, brother. All handcrafted on there. Hand painted. Hand painted. You know. Hopefully you guys enjoy what, what I bring to you guys. Hopefully it, it, it brings some memories. He wrestled for the NWA. Who liked the NWA? UWF. WCCW. Back in the days. Raise your hands. Go back and do the homework. And look at all the great videos on YouTube, brother. Wow, Jim Cornette, brother. Wow, and I was speaking. Whoa, 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 what's going on? Is it another earthquake? Oh, no, Jack. We're going to keep this show going on, brother. We got to keep it moving. We got to keep it pressing on. I was speaking of Jerry the King. I forgot what I was going to say already. Because that, that, that threw a shot wave through me, brother. About Jerry the King Lawler. I'm trying to think because the memory ain't what it used to be, brother. The memory is not what it used to be. I totally forgot. I was going to say something about Jerry the King Lawler, bro. Brother, let me jump right into the next custom review. That over there that you saw fall was the NWA title that little Alex and me created the other day when we were when we're locked down in quarantine and... We run the lockdown, brother. We put our creativity to use. We put our minds together. And we came up with that great NWA heavyweight title, brother. I'll fix it later before the video is over with, brother. The first review that I want to check in with you guys. Check out that portrait back there, brother. Check out that, that, that poster out there. Custom made, brother. Just for you guys. So that every time we have something different going on. So that it's not the same thing in every video that we have. Whether it's the figures put up. It's something different that's uniquely. And uniquely like that thing. Like that belt falling down brother. It's something great always happening here on this channel brother. Check it out. Check out this next review. Of Mattel Elite Brutus. The Barber Beefcake, brother. The Mega Powers. One half of the Mega Powers, I believe, brother. Check out the back. He was, this was when he was in that boating accident, right? He came back with that mask on because he had that facial in injury. I heard that he was scheduled to win the Intercontinental Heavyweight Championship, but then that accident happened, occurred, and detoured everything. If I'm not sure, I'm, 
I think Hogan was with them in that boating accident. But check that out. That is a pretty cool custom there. If I do say so myself, brother. Not, not a custom. That's a pretty cool figure. I didn't make it, but check that out, brother. And it's a pretty big figure. That's what I like about the Mattels. They kind of do their, their, their figures according to each, the statue of each uh, professional wrestler, brother. I got something very special for you guys today because we don't just do professional wrestling here to, on this channel, brother. I promised you guys that. As you can see with that Heathcliff in the background, brother. Or that, uh, I think I have a little uh, thing over there, Pac-Man, because we're big fans of the 80s, brother. And I just wanted to come in here and share with you guys and spend some time with you guys and uplift you guys and plant the seeds of consciousness within you guys, brother. So hopefully I could bring some joy to you guys and enlightenment of your consciousness above and beyond, brother. The next review that I have for you guys right now, right now, and those customs that I shared, not the beefcake, because that was a Mattel one. Sometimes my mind sleeps, brother. Those customs, I had to share them with you guys because, like I said, tomorrow they're getting shipped off to their owners, brother. So I had to hurry up and put something together so I could share with you guys. Because I'm pretty sure, shout out to all the customizers out there, brother, that are above and beyond, brother. Keep it going. Keep the creativity flowing, brother. Keep it pushing like they say, brother. When you're in alignment with your passion, when you're in alignment with your creativity, 10,000 hours of mastery, brother, you can't help but to reap the rewards, brother. You cannot help but to reap the rewards with your pure intent. If that makes any sense, Jack, check out this Legos. I don't know. I wasn't into Legos when I was a kid, but I wish that I was because, man, when little Alex was the first of my three kids to get into the Legos, I said, man, what? these things are pretty cool. And not only are they pretty cool, but they got, they tap into different lines whether it's wrestling whether it's movies marvel they do all kinds of stuff so they keep it flowing if you know what i mean jack they keep it flowing so and this is one of our greatest enjoyments our movies i don't know well i don't think you could see it but there's a ghostbusters back there and i let the cat out of the bag with that it's a legos Ghostbuster, brother. The Ecto-1. Still mint in the box. Little Alex had one. He opened it. He put it together. And as Legos come, Legos go. And the world of kids didn't last too long. And now he wants begging to open this. But I'm going to keep it in the box. I'm going to keep it in the box. I think I got a couple more of these lying around somewhere. It comes with the three figures, the Proton Packs, the Ecto-1. Stands. Who else is under? I forgot their names, brother. I'm old. But it's a pretty cool Lego and it's in great shape. These are not up on the store name, not item name. These are in my personal collection. So I think that's pretty cool. If you're Lego fans, if you're 80s fans, I mean, hold on to those for a couple years. Watch how they go through the roof. Everything goes through the roof right now. And right now is the time because you go to the targets open, they need to get the Hobby Lobby open. They need to get, oh, they need to get the Michaels open because during this time, a time for creativity and passion, but yet all those places are closed. 
but Walmart does sell a couple arts and crafts, not too much, but they sell some type of arts and crafts, so does Target. And if you can, if you need pens or markers, Sharpie markers, online sells them. And I found some for even cheaper than that because Michael said that they were available for curbside pickup, but not my Michael's. And the other one that I said in the other couple of videos ago that there was another store that's an arts and craft. It's I I figured it out because it takes a couple of days for my mind to kick in, brother. Because I'm old already. It takes a couple of, you know, and it's Joanne's Fabrics, brother, that has great arts and crafts supplies there. Once you tap into your creativity and your passion brother and you find your lane and your niche and you keep going and you keep going because it keeps you busy keeps your mind work keeps your creativity and your passion flowing and i don't mean to make it rhyme but it sounds that good jack wow step back and just reap the rewards of whatever you find your passion and, and your creativity because when things start flowing because you should not come against any current in your life because that means you're out of alignment, brother. You're out of alignment. Did you hear that? Did you hear that go off when I went like that? Picking up on something, brother. Picking up on something. So, hope you guys enjoyed the video. Hopefully, with what we share today brought some joy and it raises your vibration, raises your frequency. And puts a smile on your face. Because that is our pure intent here with what we share and what we create. And in creating this, it's to bring enjoyment and enlightenment into your life. And set you on the right path. So, never forget to follow your passion. Right now, whether it's painting, whether it's creating, whether it's writing, poetry, music. Working on your music, whatever it is you love, get together with the kids and show them the way. Because that's a stress reliever. That's a daily implementation of self-love until you overflow. Until that bank account inside of self-love overflows. Don't let it work on the overstimulated nervous system, Jack. Turn that news on. And go outside so with that thank you very much for being here with us thank you so much we are in gratitude for you if you like subscribe press the like button share thank you so much see you next time many blessings to you guys thank you so much we love you guys have a good one bye